Hello my loves and welcome back. Today I'm coming to you guys with my what's supposed to be my November Lip Factory box but through some confusion from their part I received both the November and December products. They did send the products for December complimentary because there was quite a bit of a mix up so I should have gotten this box sooner but because everyone else was pretty much getting their November and December box and I opted out after November um, they mixed mine up so I got both uh, November and December so I got this box last night and I'm gonna go right in and open it because I only broke the seal I really wanted to open it but I wait for y'all sometimes <laughs> Ooh, wow that's a lot. so this box is pretty full <laughs> so I'm gonna try to go through these products fast okay so the first thing I see here is from essence and it is a lash and brow gel mascara and it comes in a clear plastic uh, tubing the brush looks pretty large that's uh, pretty decent size um, does it have a smell uh, smells like brow gel <laughs> and so this will probably just end up going in my kit because I don't use it too much personally so all right so that's not bad so the next thing I see here is the Jessie's girl coal formula eyeliner and it comes with a uh, charger I was gonna say charger it comes with a sharpener and I want to open this, but I have so many black liners that I think I'm just going to give this to a friend. So I'm going to just put this away. But Jessie's Girl is a really great brand. I have their liquid eyeliner, which I love. And it comes in their silver bullet pen, which I'll show you guys right here. This is like amazing. So if you're looking for any Jessie's Girls products, I I'll recommend this. I'm not going to be opening this and trying it out. But it says Cole Formula, so it's probably soft or just very pigmented so that's going to a friend next thing I see here is a super cute <laughs> that's the name lip gloss and the color is in happiness and it comes with just what I can see I can see through the tubing I'm not gonna open this um, I'm not really into lip glosses like that I used to be a long time ago especially with my Mac lip glosses and I still am to an extent um, but just some I just don't use a lot of lip glosses I am very very picky with lip glosses but this is nice and it looks very sheer even though it's bright pink in the bottle um, it has some glitters on it but I know someone that loves lip glosses and I know she don't mind getting this in a box so yeah that's cute and I love the name it's called happiness we can all use a little happiness in our lives the next thing I see is what is this this is the twist and kiss from J cat Beauty, which I love J-Cat Beauty. They have some amazing pigmented, um, they look like, uh, you know, the Too Faced melted lipsticks, but they're more on the uh, glossy side. And this is the Twist and Kiss Hydrating Lip Balm, and the color is in Love Kiss. It looks pink. Mm. It has a nice soft scent to it. This is a really pretty pink it's not too bright I'm sure it can sheer out on the lips and you can use that as a stain I think this is really cute ooh, 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 ooh. the next thing I see here is from Mirabella and I received one of these I want to say in my wantable box and this is a lip crayon as well it's a di oh good it's a different color and this is ooh red red velvet lip pencil and these are super super pigmented from the first one that I got I'm just gonna assume that the formulation is the same just just let's see oh yes yes let's do a big swatch of that bad boy it is a really pretty red looks like the color I have on my lips today has a very soft vanilla scent uh, definitely keeping that because me and reds me and reds and this is my second Mirabella um, lip crayon so Yay, I'm starting a little collection here. So the next thing I see here is from T's Trendy Cosmetics. And it is their Golden Glow Lip Gloss. Um, I received a product from them before, which is really pretty. Oh, this one's called Desert Lily. And I don't know if I'm going to swatch this because it's a lip gloss. Their packaging is like amazing. Um, I might want to swatch this. Um, on the tube where it kind of separates a little bit, it looks... It looks iridescent. It's very baby peachy pink, but on my light here, it looks almost purpley. It smells like honey. Oh yes, okay, I might keep this. <laughs> this is very sheer, 
Let me see if I can get a good swatch. I don't think you guys will see it in the camera too much, but I can zoom in. Zoom in? Zoom in. It just has a nice glow to it. The next thing here is Medusa's Makeup Cruelty Free, Free Lip Gloss. You guys are really sticking me with the lip glosses here today. So the November box was mostly about lips, so I'm sure most of these products were in the November box. Oh my gosh, look at that. This is like a reddish, what color is this? Space Invader is the name. I kind of want to swatch this, but I kind of want to send it to a friend. <laughs> um, I'm tempted to swatch it. No, I won't swatch it. <laughs> I'll open it though. Oh, I should assume. It looks like it's going to be very sheer, but it has lots of flecks of glitter. So, oh, I see some things here. Um, this one's from Bella Pierre Cosmetics, and it's a lipstick, it has to be. And this is Couture. Let's see. Oh, the name is Couture, and this packaging is nice. It's got some like quilted, reminds me of the Revlon packaging for the lip glosses with the quilted like design you guys see that again with the light vanilla scent oh oh yeah this is getting swatched Not the prettiest of swatches but there it is right there it looks like rebel from mac and it kind of this kind of has like a magenta it's not shimmery by any means but it does color shift a little bit all right okay I'm all about the lipsticks. It's not many lipsticks I don't like, except for the shimmery, shiny ones. And I got another Bella Pierre lipstick. I was just going to open it, guys. I wasn't going to tell you nothing. And it's called Va Va Boom. The names are on the bottom. It looks red. Is this red? Oh, look at that. It's like a pinky. It's like a, a rose. Yeah, a rose. This is a pink that I would wear because it's closest to red. It's very dark. But it's vibrant, just not so vibrant that I can't wear that throughout the whole year. This is beautiful. I just have to smell everything. Do you guys do you guys do that too? Or am I just the only weird one? Okay. So they didn't send me a card or anything, so I don't know how much everything cost. But I'm sure these are a little pricey. Alright, so this is a Mimi Me Shimmer Stack in Gold Illuminating Powder. Oh my gosh. Reveal the goddess in you with the ultimate fusion of five shimmer pop Is this a shimmer brick? Like, oh my god, look at the packaging. Do you guys see that? It's kind of plasticky. I do have, look, I keep this in hand at all times. This I got from Lip Factory, which is the Me 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 Blush Me, and this is in Coral. Look at that. I use it. I beat it up a little bit. Oh my god, it has a full-size mirror. I'm not going to blind you guys with it. And it is like a shimmer brick. It's very pale. Um, it's not too dark, but it has some beautiful colors to it. Let's swipe it all. But it's just pretty. It is like a natural, well, on my skin, it would look like a natural golden color rather than like really heavy golden. This is nice. This and the lipsticks really, really, really got my attention. <laughs> so that is pretty much it, guys, for my November, December Lip Factory box unboxing. This will be it. I will not be having the service anymore. I have moved on to Wantable, and for good reason, because I was not, you know, happy with um, the delivery of this product. So I hope, uh, you know, I wish them the best, and I hope that if you guys like this box, you join. I do have the link down below. I also have a reference code. I don't know what that does. I just have a reference code. I don't know if anyone's used it, <laughs> to be honest. But um, yeah, just check them out if you like what you see. It is $22 a month for their subscription. I was hoping I didn't have anything on my teeth. Yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you guys like this video. Please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.